डॉक्टर पंकज चतुर्वेदी एंड सिंस ही इज वन ऑफ द लीडिंग सर्जन ऑफ टाटा मेमोरियल हॉस्पिटल यू कैन थ्रो अट मोर लाइट ऑन द डिफरेंट मिथ्स दैट वी हैव अरा सर हाउ मेनी नंबर ऑफ वैप्स इज डू वी डू एवरी डे इन टाटा मेमोरियल हॉस्पिटल See, we must be doing at least for oral cancer at least two uh, hundred biopsies every day. Okay. And uh, do you uh, get any complications related related to those biopsies? Biopsies never uh, are cause of problem. The problem is the tumor itself. If a tumor is so big and it is very vascular, it will bleed regardless of biopsy. therefore sometimes people are worried that biopsy has caused a bleeding it is uh, a myth now the other problem is that it all depends on uh, the amount of bleeding 99% of the time the bleeding is so less that a small gentle packing itself takes care of the bleeding so whether bleeding is there or not is immaterial because most of the time the bleeding is controllable okay that answers my myth number 1 there's another myth also <coughs> which is a biopsy or a lesion can lead to flare up of malignancy how true is that this is absolutely wrong to help for anybody to say that uh, tumor uh, flares up after the biopsy because yes biopsy is a sort of injury and it leads to some amount of inflammation and that inflammation may cause a bit of edema but that is not a tumor it is just a inflammatory response of the body and usually it subsides within 48 hours there is another myth also which says that uh, biopsy is very difficult actually if you come to our hospital biopsy is always done by the youngest of the uh, person who has not even uh, started doing big surgery so i guess biopsy is absolutely non surgical thing it can be done by anyone there's another myth which says that biopsy can lead to seeding of malignancy i have been into surgical oncology treating mouth cancers for last 15 years and let me tell you i have never seen uh, such a thing happen that uh, biopsy causes seeding uh do you need elaborate armamentarium for taking biopsies actually biopsy can be taken on a road side and if you come to our clinic you know we are at least uh, hundreds of meters away from any best infrastructure and uh, biopsy is something that can does not require anything no infrastructure it is just requires some bit of a clear mind and a punch biopsy for ourselves Uh, there's another myth which says uh, for taking a biopsy you need an uh, you need oxygen and other life support systems and devices i have never experienced <laughs> this because for me biopsy is an outpatient procedure and i'm yet to have an instance where a patient requires a life support system i think the person who says it requires a life support system and he should actually quit uh, practice of dentistry if he feels that for biopsy you require life support system uh, can you throw a little bit more light on biopsy and why it is so important in early life there is ample evidence to say that biopsy is a safe procedure it's a life saving procedure in fact i would say that if you are not performing biopsy in a clinically evident lesion or on a pre cancerous lesion you are medically liable for not doing what was important for the patient at the same time i would say that there is a 95% concordance between clinical diagnosis of pre cancer and cancer and pathological diagnosis therefore clinically when you feel something is suspicious even if you like you have decided not to treat the patient you can at least do the biopsy and these days pathologists are available everywhere and if it's not in their own city it can be sent to some other pathological lab and at least having a positive diagnosis will help the patient take a decision a lack of biopsy 
will lead to lack of diagnosis and the patient will live in this ignorance for many many months till the lesion progresses to such a huge proportion where he becomes highly symptomatic and that time if you do biopsy yes you can prove the diagnosis but you can't save the life therefore you can imagine that not doing a biopsy is doing such a huge harm to the society and you must have a very high clinical suspicion whenever you see a bad lesion unnecessary biopsy is permitted i would say i'll be very happy if i see a unnecessary biopsy but i get very upset when i see no biopsy and i would urge that every dentist should overcome the fear of doing a biopsy practice it may be coming to tata hospital or in the centers where it is being practiced and always whenever you see a suspicious lesion it should become part of the examination and you take over thank you so much